Concern on campus after a threat of violence directed at local colleges. That threat was posted on the same internet message board where the gunman in last week's Oregon mass uh, shooting issued his warning. Sunday night in the big story on Action News is a warning from federal agencies of a threat against colleges and universities in the Philadelphia area. Now, investigators say the threat made no mention of a specific school but did mention a specific time. Action News reporter David Henry live at Drexel University with details. David. Well, Walter, the threat is nonspecific, but it was, as Sarah mentioned, posted on the same message board that was apparently used by the killer in that Oregon massacre last week. And it has local students here wondering whether or not they should go to class tomorrow. No one really knows what to think about it. It's like I've never really heard about anything about that before, so like I don't really know what to do. Philadelphia area colleges have all warned students to be extra cautious tomorrow. This is the threat that was posted on 4chan, a message board where everyone is anonymous. It was posted last Friday, the day after the shooting in Oregon, and it praises the gunman as a fellow member of the Beta Rebellion. It says on October 5th at 1 p.m. Central Time, a fellow robot will take up arms at a university near Philadelphia. Federal authorities informed local schools today, and they sent out alerts to students and staff. It could be like St. Joe's, which is far away, or it could be Penn, which is right next door. And what is it going to be, too? Like, is it like a bomb or something, or just like a shooting? Like, we don't really know. The FBI says it issued the warning out of an abundance of caution. The post on 4chan uses a profile picture of what appears to be the Grinch in a mask holding a gun. That same picture was used in a post the day before the Oregon massacre that said, some of you guys are all right. Don't go to school tomorrow if you're in the Northwest. Schools in Philadelphia and the suburbs are downplaying the threat as nonspecific, but they're also taking it seriously enough to issue warnings. That has left students wondering what to do. Well, I was considering not going to class because I ha only have one class for an hour, but um, I remember that I have a written exam, so like I'm kind of forced to go. Um, so it's kind of like the whole deciding whether or not to. So I think I'm just going to be alert tomorrow and hopefully wish for the best. Nothing bad will happen. Most say they'll be on the lookout for anything that looks suspicious. After everything that has happened so far, um, people should really be aware of their surroundings and actually be precautious. Now, all of the colleges and universities in the Delaware Valley are trying to reassure students and staff by telling them they will have extra security and campus police on patrol tomorrow, supplemented by their local police departments. Live in University City, David Henry, Channel 6 Action News. Sarah? David, thank you.